Hello everyone, uh, my name is Jesus Garcia and now I'm here today with uh, my beautiful niece and goddaughter Natalie Garcia. Hey! And Natalie, what are we going to be doing today? We're going to make some guacamole. We're going to be making some guacamole. So uh, we're going to go over some of the ingredients and then we're going to get started. Natalie, can you go over the ingredients uh, for us before we get started? Two large halves of aguacates, one med set on pepper, two tablespoons of finely chopped onions, three tablespoons of fresh Mexican cream, two lime juices, one tablespoon of olive oil, eight stalks of cilantro finely chopped, salt and pepper to taste, and a small dash of garlic powder. Awesome, that's wonderful. So um, next we're going to uh, mix the ingredients in order and we'll uh, see our results. Uh, great, okay, so now that we have all of our ingredients, um, Natalie is going to be incorporating that into our bowl and I will be walking through uh, the process. So we're gonna start off with the serrano pepper. Then uh, we're going to add the uh, finely chopped onions. You can use the fork uh, too. Uh, and then we're going to uh, then add the cilantro, the uh, lime juice, the olive oil, and the uh, Mexican cream. And you want the aguacate to go at the end because uh, we want to make sure that we don't smash it too much. We want a little bit of uh, uh, chunky uh, parts to the, uh, the, the guacamole. So Natalie, if you can start with the aguacate. Awesome. You got that in one scoop, that's, that's awesome. So again, we're using a large, two large halves um, avocados. And we're using uh, the ingredients. Um, we're using the, the, uh, the uh, avocados at the very end because we want them a little bit of uh, texture. And uh, then uh, we have the salt, uh, the pepper, and the garlic going in. And then now, Natalie is going to smash the avocados and mix everything together. Right. And this is our final result. Uh, as you can tell, we did not use uh, tomatoes. Um, we don't use tomatoes in our uh, guacamole because it will turn your uh, guacamole um, uh, brown very quickly. It oxidizes the uh, the other guacamole, but we really hope that you enjoy. This is probably the uh, recipe that we've enjoyed uh, the most when we make guacamole, so uh, hopefully you'll try. Like and subscribe, and we hope you enjoy this guacamole. Thanks, guys.